every aspect of life, from what we drink to the way we grow our food and how we stay clean and healthy. In 2020, around one in four people lacked safely managed drinking water in their homes, and nearly half the world's population lacked safely managed sanitation. Every day, vulnerable communities are pushed further into poverty as a result of thirst, famine, flooding, and disease. Women and girls sacrifice their education as they shoulder a disproportionate burden for collecting and cleaning water. Climate change brings with it devastating droughts and destructive extreme weather, and these issues will only be exacerbated unless we do something. No one group can tackle these challenges alone. Strong collaboration is required to reach the targets set out in the UN Sustainable Development Goals. We need a blend of local knowledge and technical expertise and everything in between. As part of Arab's Community Engagement Programme, we work with like-minded organisations across the world that work in some of the most vulnerable communities uh, and we want to support the communities um, as a central part of our programme. The partners that we work with know their local areas really well, so they're able to bring that local knowledge. Without each other, without all of our partners and Arab working together, we would not be able to make as great an impact at a local, a wider scale. If carbon is the engine that drives the earth, then water is the fuel that drives that engine. There is so much traditional community wisdom in terms of restoring landscapes or bringing the water back. Yet that wisdom is not available to other communities where there is the same problem. Working with Arab, we could match the science and the practice together. Water-related issues are uh, uh, key for development and are key for human lives and human rights to water, especially being fundamental for, for people for uh, having a, a life worth living. West Manisha, uh, in uh, Manisha district, in an area that uh, had uh, a very low coverage due to underground water uh, complexity, salinity, mud, and uh, floods. The project was aiming to improve water situation, the access to water and that's what uh, was finally done. Working in partnership with Arup gave us the, the capacity to uh, understand and uh, provide solutions uh, to the complexity of uh, underground water resources. After more than uh, 18 months, more than 90% of the population of Illia Yosina, the access to, uh, to safe and clean water, which was a dream for them. Water improves health, education, equality and local economics all the way through to global issues such as climate resilience. Through integrated water resource management, we wanted to improve local knowledge to support water security and more importantly access to water, better sanitation and hygiene. So the benefits of working in partnership with Arup have been the skill and knowledge sharing both ways between our organisations and working with a globally known brand in the water sector. This has enabled the development of a globally applicable toolkit, which is already having great success on the ground. It's important to work on water issues because water is the backbone of all life. We have two main water-related issues, scarcity and contamination. The aquifer, which we draw our water from, is declining at an estimated rate of two to three meters per year. And we're also seeing increased contamination of arsenic and fluoride, which have major health impacts. Caminos Agua is a relatively small team, so with Arab on board, it has allowed our team to have more depth and breadth of technical expertise. The groundwater treatment system removes arsenic and fluoride. Communities are actually able to run the systems themselves, which puts the power of solving water-related issues into their hands. If everyone had access to clean water, we'd all have the opportunity to live a healthy life and build a sustainable livelihood. If everyone had access to clean water, I think all the sustainable development goals would be met. If everyone had access to uh, clean and safe water, uh, that would make their lives worth living. If everyone had access to clean water, it would reduce inequalities, disease and provide a wealth of opportunities for those most in need. If everyone had access to clean water, we would all be able to live dignified, healthy lives.